My name's Connor, and boy, do I know a lot about no. movies. Films. Film. Film. Movies. 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 Hey guys, it's Thomas Gets Tricked here, and Assassin's Creed is not a good movie. In fact, it's a really bad movie. In fact, it's a, it's a piece of shit. The Assassin's Creed movie t essentially takes everything that I like about the Assassin's Creed games and ruins it by making it have no plot that makes sense, no characters that are good. Did I mention no plot that makes sense and no characters that are good? I honestly feel like my ten-year-old brother could make a more competent film than this. Not to say that it's all bad though, the stunts are fucking incredible and the visuals are amazing. Probably, it's probably the best looking film I've seen this year, especially all the past stuff. This, the color palette, the tracking shots of the eagles, it's just, it's so good. Unfortunately all the characters are so bland that the action scenes and all the parkour and the stunts does not save this film whatsoever. It's just, it's nice that at least something about this piece of shit movie was good. I guess we should probably talk about the plot of this movie since I'm reviewing it. But that is the main problem with this movie. I don't know what the fucking plot was. I guess they were looking for the Apple of Eden, um, or the Templars were. So they got Callum Lynch to go in the Animus, where like he can relive his ancestors' memories and see if his ancestor found the Apple of Eden. But one of the biggest problems with this is if you don't play the games, which I played all the games, none of this is really gonna make a whole lot of sense to you. I was in the theater with my girlfriend and she was fucking lost the whole time. She had no idea what was going on. Another issue, which I don't know, this maybe this isn't an issue and it's just me being wrong, but I think it's an issue, is that if you've played the games, in Assassin's Creed Brotherhood, in 1507, I believe, Ezio hides the Apple of Eden in a temple in Rome, I think. Maybe not Rome, it's somewhere near there. Yeah, yeah, it's a Roman Colosseum. And then in this game, or in this movie, uh, what's his face? I forgot the past assassin's name because he was an irrelevant character. Um, he gives the apple to, oh fuck, I can't even remember. He gives the apple to somebody and it's in that person's tomb, but this is in 14. 92. Then the modern Templars at Abstergo, they go to that tomb and they find the Apple of Eden. But that doesn't make any sense because the Apple of Eden should be in the Roman Colosseum with Ezio. But then Desmond Miles in 2012 got the Apple of Eden. Fuck, I just don't know! This movie also has zero fucking humor, which is usually a complaint that I complain about because I don't think every movie has to have a whole lot of humor, like the MCU does or whatever. But literally everybody in this film is so serious, and frankly, even though I love the Assassin's Creed games, the concept is really out there and somewhat ridiculous, so they might as well have a little bit of fun with it, right? The only bit of levity in this movie is when Michael Fassbender's character, uh, he's sitting there eating food, and he kind of sarcastically is like, what the fuck is going on? And I just found that ironically funny because I didn't know what the fuck was going on either. And uh, that would have been okay if I eventually learned what the fuck was going on. But everything was so crazy and rushed that I just... I don't know. Why can't a video game movie just be fucking good? What? Oh, what's this? Peach schnapps. That sounds girly as fuck, but it's full.
I give this movie a 4 point I don't give a fuck out of 10.